Pokey is now about three weeks old and looks much more like an adult. She can fly really well now. I doubt I could catch her if she didn't want me to. She can fly straight up from the floor to the ceiling and can hover in one spot for one or two seconds. But you'll have to take my word for it because filming a bird flying in an enclosed space is a lot harder than you think. It's easy to forget that she's still a baby. So the end game plan for this little starling was always going to be to attempt to release her back to the wild. But to prepare her for the dangers of living outdoors, I need a plan. Whilst I'm not keen on keeping her in a cage, at the moment she is just too young to find food for herself or to keep herself safe from predators. Currently, her cage sits next to the window. Directly on the outside of the window is a transparent bird feeder. Below is our front garden. And just to the bottom of the screen, you can see the roof of the front porch. I hope that these will become familiar to her. Gradually, over time, I'll bring her cage out for a few minutes and place it on the roof, well out of the way of predators. This should allow her to get used to the sensations of being outdoors. Ultimately, it would be her choice where she'd rather be, but I'm pretty sure she'd rather be free than locked in a cage. So my job is to prepare her. Here we are practicing foraging. In the bowl is muesli, seeds, mealworms, blueberries, peas and raisins. None of this she'll really eat yet. She's still a bit too young, but it's good for practice. I still feed her by hand, but it's more like every hour or two now and she can eat quite a lot in one go. She's doing really well. Every day I see new skills and behaviours. I think she's going to do just fine. 